Hi friends. So we need So we made it to New York City. If you didn't watch my Pittsburgh vlog, the vlog before this, um, we were there for a little bit because Hitter and Mia's had to do some recording for their virtual season. And then yesterday, two days ago, I had a concert in New Jersey. Um, Don't you understand your mother's a YouTuber? This is very important. Ready? Get it! Anyway, I had a concert in New Jersey um, and it was like a small chamber orchestra type configuration and it was really fun and it was really crazy to be performing again for a live audience. Um, it was outdoors in this huge, beautiful field. The scenery was gorgeous and it just felt kind of surreal to be back with all of my colleagues here in the city and just be performing again and I don't know, it was kind of crazy. Um, and it was an all Mozart program, which was fun. We played a movement of Mozart 40 and it's like the weather is changing. It's already pretty chilly outside for an outdoor concert. So I don't know what's gonna happen going forward. Just really thankful that I had the chance to perform again. Um, so now we're in the city and the apartment is a disaster right now. Um, we came a few months ago, I guess back in August, I reread the Marie Kondo book and it inspired me to give away all my earthly possessions. And now I'm starting to wish that I did not because it's a wreck in here. It's about a hundred times better than it was back in August when we had taken everything. Have this. Be a good millennial doggy. Ready? Get it. So anyway, it's a disaster, but I'm hoping that during the time that we're here, I can do a bit more organizing. I think I gave away like 13 or 14 bags of clothes, or I have them ready to give away. Um, I had things from middle school, and I think it's time that I let those go. Anyway, so now we're gonna go have a coffee with my friend Julia, and then she and I are gonna rehearse a little bit because we have Another concert coming up on Thursday. the concert um, I think right now we're going to practice a little bit warm up a bit you can hear Hermes doing some of that in the background um, and then we're gonna take Miguel on a really long walk and maybe to the dog park again just so he can burn off some of his puppy energy before we have to leave him here for a few hours so anyway we're gonna do that and then the concert is at 6 30 and it is at this venue called the Norwood Club it's this private members only arts club in the city and it's in this beautiful townhouse down on 14th street we're going to be playing outside for the most part in this like patio garden area i think when santiago plays his portion on the piano obviously um it's going to be like in this 
kind of lounge area that is still like connected to the garden so there's going to be a lot of airflow and doors will be open windows open um so it should be covid social distancing friendly the concert is with this group that two of my friends and i've run and we're called sonora collective you can check out our instagram and our website i'll put that info in the description box below um, but it would be awesome if you could go over and give us a follow on instagram since we're fairly new still we basically got things up and really running at the very beginning of march or the end of february um, and obviously, as you know, everything with the pandemic kind of put that on a hold. So we're really happy that we're able to have this tiny micro event, this outdoor concert, um, just to keep things going as much as we can. Hopefully one day things will be back in full swing. So first warming up a bit, then the dog park, and then it's concert time. home from the performance it went pretty well um, it was really nice to partake in some live music again and that seemed to be the consensus of everyone who was listening that they were just like wow this is so refreshing to hear something live instead of like a live stream or just a recording online um, so it was pretty cool to be able to experience that but as we head into cooler weather here it's not going to be as possible to have these types of events but so i guess it just really makes you savor the few live performance experiences that we have while we can but i just feel so strange we were saying this to each other oh it just feels like normal times again like coming home after a performance but it's obviously not normal times so i guess it's kind of bittersweet like great to have a performance but not sure when the next one will be again tomorrow we're headed back to pennsylvania i'm not sure when we'll be back here in the city but hopefully it's not too far away i hope you guys are all doing well and that you're hanging in there and i'll see you all in my next video